Chrome OS, a Linux kernel-based operating system, is known for its speed and efficiency. To make it even better, Chrome OS supports the Google Play Store, giving you access to millions of Android apps. If you're curious about experiencing Chrome OS, buying a Chromebook is one option. However, if you already own a Windows laptop or desktop, the more practical solution is to dual boot Chrome OS alongside Windows 10 or Windows 11. Let's dive in. To successfully dual boot Chrome OS and Windows, you'll first need to disable three features, hibernation, fast startup, and secure boot. Open the command prompt as an administrator and type the following command. I will mention these commands in description so you can copy and paste it. This will turn off the hibernation feature on your computer. Next, open the registry editor and navigate to the following path. Locate the Hiberboot enabled entry, double click it and change its value from 1 to 0. This disables fast startup. Restart your computer. After restart, access the BIOS settings. Once you are in the BIOS, locate the Secure Boot option under the Security tab, disable it and save the changes and exit from BIOS. After Start Window, next step is to install Windows Subsystem for Linux. To proceed, we need to install WSL and Ubuntu on our system. Go to Start Menu and open PowerShell. And run the following command. It will download and install the Ubuntu in your system, so it will take some time. After the installation is complete, close the command line and launch Ubuntu. It will prompt you to create a username and password. Set the username for Ubuntu and password. Now, install the necessary packages using this command. When prompted, enter the password you just created. After this, next step is creating a partition for Chrome OS. Chrome OS requires at least 16 gigabytes of storage, but allocating more space is ideal. For this guide, I'll create a partition of 80 gigabytes. Create a new partition on your hard drive and name it Chrome OS. Within the Chrome OS partition, create a folder named Brunch. Download the Brunch framework from GitHub as it's essential for building a generic Chrome OS image. I will provide this GitHub link in my video description. Scroll down and download the latest file. Next step is download the Chrome OS recovery image. In browser URL type cross.tech to download the Chrome OS recovery image. Before downloading, identify which version is compatible with your processor. For Intel 6th to 9th gen CPUs, download Shyana. For 10th gen Intel CPUs, download Ginlin. For 11th gen or newer Intel CPUs, download Wool. For AMD Ryzen CPUs, download Kobos. After identifying the right version, download the latest stable build. Finally, download the Grub 2 Win tool from its official website. This will help set up the dual boot menu. I will provide this website link in my description. After downloading all the files, extract all the files you've downloaded using 7-zip or WinRAR.
After extracting all the zip files, now create a new folder and name it Chrome OS. Move the extracted files into the Chrome OS folder. Ensure there are six files in total. Rename the recovery image file to Chrome OS for simplicity. To mount the directory in Ubuntu, copy the folder path from the address bar. Open Ubuntu and paste the folder path to mount. Type cd forward slash mnt then forward slash then paste the folder path here and adjust it for Linux formatting. Replace backslashes with forward slashes, remove colons and convert everything to lowercase. Run the command, press enter, then type this command. Check the directory drive letter. In my case, I am installing in disk drive D. If you are installing on another drive, then specify yours. Now check the size for Chrome OS installation. For example, if your partition size is 97 gigabytes, input 95 gigabytes to leave a small margin. My partition size is 81. I input 79 for two gigabytes of space. After you carefully type the command, press enter to run the installation. The installation process can take up to 30 minutes. After installation, you'll be asked whether to set up Chrome OS as a single boot or dual boot alongside Windows. Type dual boot and press enter to proceed. Installation is finished. Last step is set up the Grab 2 Win tool for dual boot. Navigate back to the Chrome OS partition. Go to branch folder. Locate the Chrome OS disk image and grub text file. Open the grub file, copy its contents. Now, install grub 2 win application in your Windows. Select the target drive, it is C drive, so click on setup button. Click close the setup program button. Once installed, click manage boot menu and create a new entry. Click on add a new entry button at top side. In type drop down menu, select create user section it will open new text editor. Now paste the previously copied grub text into the editor and save. Ignore any warnings. Click apply and close the program. After everything is done, now restart your computer. From now on, every time you start your PC, the grub2 winboot manager will load. Select the branch option to boot into Chrome OS. On the first boot, you'll see the branch framework logo, followed by the Chrome OS logo. Complete the setup process as you would on a Chromebook. Once done, you can enjoy Chrome OS with full Google Play Store support. You've successfully installed Chrome OS on a Windows PC. 
While the steps may seem complex, following them carefully ensures a smooth dual boot setup. If you encounter any issues, drop a comment below and we'll help you out. Thanks for watching. If you like this video, then give it like and subscribe to my channel and I will see you in the next video.